guys and welcome back to the final part of my Kim Kardashian house building series it's Sim here today so I am very excited to show you the house it's finally finished um, and all the custom content that I have used is link on, linked on my blog which is in the descriptions below the video so i did edit some uh, cc to the list today because i went over it and i saw that i have forgotten some things so if you uh downloaded all the cc um like yesterday or the days before you really need to go back to the list there are a few new things on there that you need um, so for downloading this house you can find it on the gallery under origin id sim and phoenix or you can use um, the download links which are in the descriptions below the video uh, for my dropbox or my sim file share you can just download the house put it uh, in your tray folder i think it is uh, and then the house will appear into your gallery uh, but it will be without the custom content so you do need to download that separately and put that into your mods folder so let me show you the front of the house here we have um how do you call that i added in a floor which you saw in the previous part of this uh, series uh, and also i um, removed the arch which i placed here that was from tinger later i think that was her name uh, but she made it a paying mesh and that's why i took it out and now it's just a opening but i think it looks very nice i you don't even miss the arch so it looks it looks okay so let me show you the side of the house uh, here. I really love this very long driveway. I think that looks very chic. And let's go into the house. Um, let's see how do we do that. Um, so here we enter the uh, lobby. So as you can see it's all very white and with black uh, accents the house because that is the color palette that she has chosen to uh, decorate her house so here on the right we have a wardrobe for your sims uh, so they can uh, place their coats jackets and shoes there a little mirror where kim can check herself before she goes outside um and there is the door to the garden but we are not going into the garden yet first off i want to show you the right wing of the house which is the kitchen and master bedroom and walk-in closet so here we have a door and here we have just a little uh, storage area for your um, kitchen uh, stuff so there's a bit of cc here uh, these shelves are base game i think or maybe for get together i'm not sure and of course a uh, a old easel that they stored away here because my kim she's a artist <laughs> i don't know if she's one in real life but in my game she loves to paint um so here we have the guest bed, uh, bathroom so uh, any guests can use this bathroom when they are visiting um, Kim and Kanye. A shower and a toilet as well. Uh, so whoop, let's go back here. Here we enter the kitchen. Um, so here on the right we have a sink let's zoom out a bit um, some custom content clutter on the left and right of the shelves a coffee maker and of course a dishwasher i added that in uh, the other day because i have forgotten to do that so here on the left we have the kitchen a dining area and a seating area um, so I really do love the colors of these kitchen counters. They are from Peacemaker IC, by the way. Um, you can find them on my blog. <laughs> so I really love the layout uh, of this kitchen. Um, it's just very open, which I adore. So here we have the uh, dining area, uh, which I decorated with some plates and glasses to make it look a bit more lived in. 
and here we have a door to the uh, outdoor area again so here we have the door to Kim and Kanye's master bedroom so here you come into the hallway let's zoom out a bit and you can go left or right so at the right side you have the whoops that's too high the walk-in closet and on your left you have the bedroom so we're going into the bedroom right now and as you see i love this little area um, this is just a little place where kim or kanye can relax before turning into bed and of course a fireplace with a big screen tv um, and of course the bed, uh, which is from Peacemaker, I see as well. Um, and a uh, rock from Praline Sims. So yeah, here is just a little seating area. And when you can go, when you go outside, you have a little seating area here when you're, where your Sims can relax and just have a beautiful overview of the uh, garden, which I think that's the best part of the house is the garden. I really do love it. Um, so here we go back in. And through this archway here, we go into the master uh, bathroom. And as you can see, everything is very open because this is her, Kim and Kanye's private uh, wing. So no one comes here except for, uh, yeah. Uh, them <laughs> so here of course two sinks uh, a little uh, makeup station and the bed top with some toiletries of course and marble flooring um, and here we go into the uh, walk-in closet I really really love this walk-in um, it's a bit similar to um, Jennifer, no, not Jennifer, not, not my Jennifer Lawrence build, my Kylie Jenner build. She also has uh, that kind of mirror and uh, I think the same cabinets as well I used for her uh, walk-in. Um, so yeah, you have a uh, his and hers size side. Here on the left you have um, Kanye's side and on the right it skims her side with all her dresses and shoes. So here, uh, of course, her bags, a little seating area. And outside, I made a little seating area as well. So they can uh, enjoy the sunshine when uh, fitting on some new clothes. <laughs> so that is the uh, right wing of the house. So let's go into the uh, left side. So let's go back to the lobby. So we are back into the lobby and here you have the stairs to go upstairs to the children's bedrooms and the guest bedrooms as well. But we are going to go into that uh, a little bit later. So here you have uh, a hallway that I furnished off camera. I just added a ottoman and some plants. And uh, there are some side tables and uh, just some uh, clutter and a mirror. So here you go into a, a second living room. And I think that this living room is for parties or guests because it's a bit more fancy. And it has a grand piano for you to use and uh, entertain your guests, of course. Um, so... Let's go a bit back because we have, of course, the spa, which I want to show you guys first. Uh, you go into the spa right here and on your right side, you have the changing area. So they can change into a towel to head on into the spa. And here they can get a massage or a uh, manicure, pedicure or something like that. Um, and then when they go straight through here, you have on the left side a sauna and a shower as well. Um, I do love this spa. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. I love the spa uh, game pack. If you haven't uh, bought that, you really should because it's excellent. I do use a lot of the uh, stuff in that pack. 
Here you have the uh, gym. So I have uh, two of these equipment. I don't know how they are called. And two treadmills and a punching bag for Kanye, of course, because sometimes he can get a bit frustrated and he can get take it out on the punching bag right here. <laughs> So you can go uh, through this door and you can go back into the uh, second living room, which we are right now. Um, so yeah, of course, these painting with paintings, which I use a lot in a lot of builds. I think I really love the re recolors on them. They are gorgeous. Um, so yeah, here we go into the... Uh, formal dining room and at first I had another lamp there another chandelier but I replaced it with this one which I think looks a lot better because the other one intersected with all of the plates and the uh, glasses and it didn't look nice so this is much better uh, and of course a uh, bookcase if they want to read or do something like that um, and here we have a third seating area this house has a lot of seating areas but they have a really big family so i think that's very important so here we go into another hallway and here on the left we have the garage so um all of the cars and the scooters are from max sims that is linked on my blog as well. i added in these columns uh, next to the uh, garage doors i i just thought it looked a bit weird without them so it looks more finished and i added in two windows there because i totally forgot the windows um and of course two um secu security cameras but i already put it in uh two episodes ago and here just uh, a area where your sims can um i don't know work on their cars perhaps <laughs> So going back through the door, we have of course a fire uh, extinguisher, very handy if your sims have a fire. So upstairs we have the office area, So and I replaced the um, desk that I had with a uh, get together, no, get to work desk I think. Or maybe it's a base game desk. I'm not sure. But I did replace it uh, with this desk because the other one was glitching. I think it wasn't very good CC, so I took it out of my game. Um, and of course, these uh, beautiful bookshelves from Lenny Sims, I think that's her name. So here, a, oops, <laughs> a little uh, area for your sim to paint uh, as I said my Kim in this safe is uh, a real painter she loves to paint uh, so that's why I added that in here on the uh, left side we have a little bathroom um, and I did edit a shower here I at first it was only a toilet but I thought yeah it was a real long distance to the first bathroom so i just added in a shower just for some convenience if you have a sim that loves to paint like my sim you can uh, give it really quick showers in between um so that's all of the um downstairs area so this is the, all of the first floor and let's go into the second floor with the uh, children bedrooms and the guest bedrooms of course so here we have uh, the second floor oh sorry and here you see the lobby where you come in and up here you go into uh, the stairs and up to this little balcony area and the first door right here is the girls bedroom which i already showed you guys in uh, the last uh, no i think two episodes ago but i did change it up a bit which i really want to show you guys um so let's go in here so as you can see i added in a um, wardrobe and i gave it a fun very bright wallpaper i really love this wallpaper it's from praline sims i already used this paper i think in my um nursery my cc nursery uh, if you haven't seen that 
video you really should it's on my channel um, just a cute little girls nursery with lots of bold colors so here a little uh, seating area for her to uh, play with her tea set <laughs> um, so yeah and all of her toys and that stuff so going out the door and to the left we have uh, the first guest bedroom so this house only has five bedrooms two guest bedrooms two children rooms and the master bedroom so this is one of the guest bedrooms and i really love the color combination with the blue the white and the black um, and the little mickey painting of course because i am a real disney freak <laughs> um, so i really love this room i think this is one of my favorite uh, guest bedrooms that i have made but the other one, one is also very beautiful so it's hard to decide um so yeah here of course a little seating area for your sim to uh, do her makeup of or his makeup makeup <laughs> and a wardrobe as well i think every um bedroom has its own wardrobe except kim and kanye they have a walk-in closet so here uh through here we have the uh bathroom there's only one bathroom upstairs because i didn't have enough space so the toilet is around the corner and a wall for some privacy um, a shower of course which is enclosed into a door and a okay, just a, i just made a little cabinet i really love making the, these shower cabinets for your sim and a bath as well and of course another wardrobe so going out there into the boys nursery uh, which looks very cute um, so I placed some uh, toys on the ground like if uh, someone was playing with it also a wardrobe and a little seating area as well so going out here and into this little hallway we have uh, another guest bedroom i added on a floor above the kitchen because i was missing a bedroom um so yeah this is also a very lovely color palette i adore blacks whites and grays because i already said it in other uh, episodes that is the color palette of my house um and that's why i do use that a lot um so yeah this is a lot of furniture from furnishing from peacemaker i see um but i do love this room so i think that is everything so that's the we did the ground floor and the second floor and now we are going into the um garden so here we have the um first seating area which you see when you go come out of the house um, you have a chimney right here and a fireplace on the left i also have a chimney but no fireplace but you can manually add them in if you think you need uh, one more um, so when you turn around here you look uh, to the vineyard and the pool with all the um, fountains in it they do have fountains in their real life pool by the way and that's why i added in fountains in this pool um so on the left here we have a seating area again um, but she has a large family as i said so they do need a lot of seating areas so here we have the uh, barbecue area and here you see my uh, Kim and Kanye just chilling um, he's making some burgers and she's just watching him cook <laughs> um, I found these sims from the gallery by the way they are not mine I I really suck in create a sim um, I think they are the first sims that you see when you use hashtag Kim and Kanye I just uh, picked them up from the gallery um, and that's a uh, CC dress that I already had in game um, so yeah this is the barbecue area when we go through here let's go let's do it like this I have um, the garden the, the bins right here 
as you can see and of course the trees to cover it a bit up um, so when you go through here uh, you see um, I added in a uh, bar here because that was, was missing and I really didn't know where they had a bar but I just added a bar in here with uh, some ivy at the back and I really think it looks very nice um, this little bar area very cute and uh, a bit romantic so here another seating area with a fireplace which looks absolutely gorgeous and when your sim is sitting here like right here and you go, can go like this and you have a beautiful view of the house and the pool and a bit of the garden and I really love this little pool house it's absolutely gorgeous and when you walk through here you go into the vineyard and they're already uh, placed some uh, how do you call that grapes <laughs> grape bushes <laughs> I don't know but I already placed them and let them grow a bit and let's see um, they are how does that work can you see I really don't know but I think they are like evolved two or three times already and the quality was uh, fine last time I checked but this is the uh, little vineyard which looks also very nice uh, and of course the view from here is also very beautiful so this is the entire backyard uh, and that was the house tour of the Kim Kardashian house or the Kim Kardashian mansion so yeah let me know what you guys think of the house um, I am really happy with the results I absolutely adore it so for the non-custom content version that is coming i promise i am working on it uh, like right now i'm just trying to figure out some things i really want uh, to put in some um, paint from reference paintings but it keeps coming up as custom content and i don't know why so that's what i'm going working with uh, right now but that will be online i hope for the next weekend so keep an eye out for that so i'm going to leave you guys uh, with this uh, please leave a like a comment anything i really would like to hear from you guys and if you like it please hit the like button if you love it subscribe and i will see you next time bye bye